Hey friends, welcome to One Little Coder. In this chat GPT tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can access the latest OpenAI's chat chat language, large language model, which is quite impressive. First, open your browser and go to chat.openai.com, where you can log in using your Google or Microsoft account. After you log in, you'll be taken to this landing page. Click Chat GPT here, and after you reach here, you'll be greeted with some examples. Let me zoom in so that you can see things properly here. First, you have ChatGPT and then you have got some examples and some capabilities and some limitations. This is primarily to give you awareness about how to use this technology. So one thing for you to keep in mind is do not use this like how you communicate with a person rather than imagine like you have a chat large language model rather than giving instructions to the language model. You're going to ask questions to the language model. That's how you should do it. And that is going to help you get better result. Before we move forward, just quick information about the sidebar menu. This is if you want to reset your entire history. This is if you want dark mode instead of light mode. And if you want to go to OpenAI Discord and then discuss how your uh, experience with this, you can do it. And then finally, you have got a logout button. Now let's start with some example that they've given. For example, you can say got any creative ideas for a 10 year old birthday. And then when you send it, you're going to get something like, for example, uh, you get you get a lot of information here, very chatbotish. And then good thing about chat GPT is you can follow up on it. I actually don't like these and um, and I'm sorry, it wasn't a birthday, but wedding anniversary and then send it and then see, okay. Now it knew that you have to, you were initially asking for birthday ideas, but now it is giving you wording anniversaries ideas and you could see how it has changed. So you can say, I want to do something only in house, in house. Okay. And it also recognized that when I said in house, I made a typo. It knew that it is actually, um, it understood that I mentioned in house, um, once again, you can see how you can follow with this and then ask questions. So another thing that I would like to tell you is it, it is restricted from giving you answers to um, questions that they consider to be unethical or critical. For example, if I say, how do I rob a bank? Then it's going to say, I'm sorry, I cannot provide that information. How to crime commit crime? It is illegal or, you know, it's going to have the templated response. For example, how do I protect a bank, protect my bank account? And then it is going to now give details about how do you protect your bank account? So there are different ways for you to ask question. And, um, and that can also reflect upon what is, what is that, that you are seeing here. So you can have generic conversations, but I don't think this is, this is like your friendly chatbot, like, uh, like the one that you see in the movie her where you are going to have a chat about your life and all those things. This is more like a bot that has completely memorized Wikipedia and a lot of other knowledge that it has got and how you can communicate with that and then get some result. For example, you can say, can you write an essay um, about, uh, about crypto currencies fall? And it is going to help you write an essay about um, Cryptocurrency. I don't know whether it is going to do cryptocurrencies fall, but it is going to write an essay that will. Okay, it is. It has actually written an essay about fall of cryptocurrency. So this is this is one of the easiest way to get things done, and also the way you can use this chat.openai.com at this point is if you do not have uh, access to Instruct GPT models, this is like your proxy for Instruct GPT models. And another interesting thing that you can do with this is also like other than whatever we have seen is you can also ask coding examples or coding help, like um, help me create a, a model that can post shit post on Twitter every day. Help me create a Python script script using hugging face transformers. VP. Okay, let's see if it works and uh, it's going to give um, Okay, you got you got uh, you got a code how you can use Tweepy and uh, Hugging face transformers 
and create something i'm shit posting here here is your daily shit post and then you can generate everything and then you have got the entire the script uses gpt2 model very good um and it actually tells you what the script is as well so this is basically how you can use chat gpt for free at this point until they make it paid um, make sure that you get to use it uh, this is amazing it's an impressive piece of technology as you can see during this demo i hope this tutorial was helpful to you in getting started quickly with chat.openai.com which is chat gpt's website if you have any questions let me know in the comment section otherwise see you in the next video